exclusive, live on YouTube around 4 p.m. EST, Monday, Thursday, Friday. Follow for notifications. Yo, what's up, my massive family? Welcome back to Ark Survival Evolved. We're gonna go ahead and battle heart. Wow. Oh my god. Oh, that's a good looking. Tr that's a good looking Dillo. Okay, so I'm getting distracted here. That's a nice color. Looks like a looks like an 80s He-Man figure. I'm gonna go ahead and equip our bow. We've already got uh, narco arrows or trank arrows, whatever you want to call them. So we're gonna go ahead and trot. Oh no. Oh no, my trike killed it already. Oh, it was so damn awesome looking. Well, that is a loss. Thanks a lot. Thanks a lot, Trunk. <laughs> uh, so anyway, the purpose of this episode is to gather some metal and stuff that you find on top of mountains and also battle harden our trike. So we're gonna go ahead and start using our trike for battle. Yeah! Now this thing's only a level five, so I'm hoping it's not gonna put up much of a fight. We're just going head on, spearing this thing with our trike. Oh, nice. And we killed it. Killed it dead. Let's see what it's got on itself. We could always use more hides, so I'm gonna go ahead and take our hatchet, which you can use to gather hide off of dead dinos, and we're gonna go ahead and gather as much hide as we possibly can, since we have plenty of meat. Can you do the Optimus Prime voice? All right, Lewis. Keep in mind, though, I haven't practiced it, so it'll be a little off, but I'll do my best. I'll do my best. <clears throat> Sam, the Cube. My name is Optimus Prime, leader of the Autobots. <clears throat> Sam, the Decepticons are invading your world, and they seek the Cube. The Allspark. The cube holds which all us Transformers have in its life force. The Allspark. <clears throat> That's a little bit of Optimus Prime. I'll do a little bit of Duke Nukem too, since I'm sure somebody has asked for Duke Nukem. That's, uh, that's the crowd favorite around here. <clears throat> the name's Nukem. Duke Nukem. I've got balls of steel. Blow it out your ass. Eat shit and die. Ah, uh, a little strong warden, but whatever. We're killing animals. Killing animals. We can use for a little. We can use little cuss words. The name's Nukem. Duke Nukem. And I'm gonna chain this, uh, this badass trike in this live stream. What level are you? You are level. Ah, uh, hell. What does it matter? Let's just attack. <laughs> yeah! Come on, come on, boy. You got this. Health-wise, he's doing pretty good. So I have a feeling this thing is... Yeah, it's in the bag. He was only level 5. Uh, the reason we're not going to kill that Brontosaurus... I'm sure some of you guys will be like, KILL! KILL THE Brontosaurus! We're not going to kill a Brontosaurus because... We're going to tame it. Our objective in this playthrough is to tame everything. Literally, everything. Every dinosaur, we want at least like one of each. We're getting in a high populated area, so it's starting to lag a little bit. This is an early access alpha game, so it is still in development. Can't blame it for not being super silky smooth or something. Hey, we got a level up. Oh, it's uh actually a level up for our trike. Whoa, a lot of lag. Usually never lags this much. I'm gonna go ahead and upgrade his health. Yeah, excellent. He is now level 9, and that is exactly what, like, we're trying to do. We're not only trying to head to a mountaintop to get a lot of metal and resources that we need for our base, but we're also trying to battle harden this trike. And you know what? I actually wish that I tamed that trike, because look how awesome he looks. He's got some nice color. Even though it was level 2, this thing showed promise. It's a beautiful trike. Not as... Gorgeous is our truck trike, but it's up there. Uh, when are we streaming Mad Max? Real soon. If not today, then definitely tomorrow. Nice. All right, let's head out, trunk. So that looks like it's pretty high up there. We're gonna make our way to the top of that mountain, 
and find whatever resources we can that are on top of mountains naturally, like metals, for instance. We need a lot of metals. We need some other unique stuff as well. How was the massive one tonight? Asks Shawi82. Good. Damn good. Aside from my neck. <laughs> oh man, I must have really pulled maybe, hopefully not tore. I don't think I tore anything. I pulled something really, really bad in my neck and my shoulder yesterday. I thought that going to sleep would make it better, but it was extreme, extremely painful for you. No, it was extremely painful for me last night because oh, hard to sleep. And I woke up like, shit. I feel worse than I did last night. <laughs> Today is not going to be a great feeling day for my back and my neck. Ouch. Hey, look at that. We got even hide and even meat, even though we should have gotten more hide than meat. Because we're using a hatchet and not a pickaxe. Very weird. Whatever. Should tame one more trike. Oh, like, like a male trike and a female trike? I think I see where you're going with this. Kind of like an arc thing. <laughs> Ark! There you go. We're gonna arc the ark. We're gonna build an ark on ark. Ark the ark. Actually, you know what? We should build a massive. Okay, we couldn't do it without cheats, honestly. Because, uh, <laughs> you know, we only got one person building. However, cool theory. Cool. Well, it's not really a theory. Cool idea. We build a humongous ark. A big, massive wooden metal ark. And. Like. That is what we keep all of our dinos in, and we get like two dino of each dino in the game, and we put it in that huge wood metal arc. However, two of every dino in the game would require this arc that we would build to be humongous, like extraordinarily large. We have an army of insects after us. They can be very, very, very difficult, so I'm going to hop on my trike and let the trike deal with it. All right, now that we have moved away from the high population area, it's starting to even out, yeah. It's feeling a lot better now. Okay, this is exactly where we want to be, actually. We're starting to, like, reach some of these some of these rocks that may have metal. So let's go ahead and switch to our pickaxe. And let's, <laughs> let's start picking. Universe Sandbox, have I played it? No, I've never played that, actually. Hey, one of you guys is sick, so no school tomorrow. Congratulations, spend it well. If you got homework, do yourself a favor and get it all out of the way in the morning. That's just Flint. I don't want Flint. Get it all out of the way in the morning, that way you don't have to worry about it. Because if, like, if you're anything like me, if you have something that you have to do, you can't enjoy yourself. You can't enjoy it. It's just going to loom over your head and you're going to be like... Ugh, but I do have that thing that uh, that I have to do, and I don't want to do it. So I'm just gonna be thinking about that the whole time. I'm trying to enjoy myself. I got that problem. I got that problem big time. Unfortunately, it looks like none of these rocks actually host any metal. I'm gonna try this rock. See if we can get some metal out of this. Flint, just Flint again. Ah, it's just Flint. Oh, let's get back on Tronk and tame, or not tame, let's train Tronk with this Triceratops. Luckily, this Triceratops already has its hands full with a Raptor. And you know what? Ah, uh, crap. Raptor's dead. I was gonna try to tame it. How you doing, Tronk? Tronk is doing pretty good. I mean, Tronk just took down a level 41 Raptor. Granted, whatever level this thing was, this was level 6, Trike, so that didn't deal much damage to this Raptor before we got here. Uh, Tronk did a damn good job taking down a level 41 Raptor. I'm proud of you, boy. Nice job. Very nice. This a metal thing? This metal rock? Nah, it's not a metal rock. Thought maybe it could have been by part of the hue. 
Okay, we slipped. We gotta get back the trunk. How far are you in Arc Massive? We're getting there. I mean, currently we are level 33. So, hey, here we go. Here we go. Maybe those other ones weren't glistening enough. Because this one's glistening a whole bunch. Yup, you know what? The other ones, they just weren't glistening enough. We, we need to... I forgot how bright they are. Maybe it's the game's been updated a little too much for me to remember correctly, but Yep, this is what they look like, so let's remember it. One of you guys just brought up uh, Lego Dimensions. Uh, yes, Lego Dimensions does have portal. Not only does it have portal, we gotta repair our pickaxe. We only need Thatch to repair it, so that's good. We can get Thatch by punching this tree. Uh, Lego Dimensions not only has Portal, but it has Back to the Future, it has Ghostbusters, it has Lord of the Rings, it has Scooby-Doo, which is really sweet. It's got, oh, what else does it have? Uh, the Lego Movie the cast, of course. And it's got Batman, Nolan North Batman, Arkham Knight Batman, which is super badass. I wonder if we can hit this thing with our trike. And get resources out of it. Let's try it. Beep, 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 beep. Backing it up. Beep, beep. Slow as hell. Beep, beep. It's not like we have workers' cops to worry about. Trunk, just back up. Damn. No, we gotta use our pickaxe. Ah, oh, that sucks. That sucks. Well, let's get at it. Ah, uh, so much stone, so little metal. Whoa, I'm sorry. Okay, that was your fault. Honestly, you walked into me, Trunk. <laughs> You're not the brightest dino out of, the, out, of, out of the dinos on this dino island. Let's just get that out of the way right now. Oh, right, so Lego Dimensions. The best thing about that is that they're all voiced by the real deal. Like, Batman in the game is voiced by Nolan North, right? Uh, Chris Pratt voices Owen Brady in, like, le the Lego Jurassic World thing. Chris Pratt, like, has unique lines for Owen Brady. All this stuff is unique voices, by the way. It's not like they just took clips of the movie like they did for previous games. Like Lego Lord of the Rings or Lego Jurassic World. Um, Chris Pratt also voices Emmett from the Lego movie in Lego Dimensions. And you've got, uh, uh Marty McFly is voiced by... Uh, the actor that played Marty McFly, I can't remember his name for some reason, Michael J. Fox. There we go. <laughs> Sir Ian McKellen voices Gandalf, which is just incredible. Bill Murray is going to voice his Ghostbuster. And yeah, it's just awesome. It's just so goddamn quality, and I am loving it. Of course, the voice of GLaDOS is voicing GLaDOS, and so on and so forth. And that's just awesome. I'm going to go ahead and fill up our water pouch because we're getting a little thirsty. Tacticians suggest that we should build a house out of wood. We actually uh, are like in the process of building a house out of wood and stone. Oh shit! Oh shit! Cancel that. Can't cancel that. Cancel. Cancel. Stop crafting. Clear, clear crafting. Stop crafting. Fuck my life. Oh god, I just made three damn water pouches. Oh my god. Screw all of you things. Oh, Jesus. I wasted so much hide on that. I didn't need to waste that much hide. I still don't know how to stop construction. I still don't know. Whatever, now we got a whole bunch of water pouches. Like an idiot. Alright, let's get back to our trike. Trunk! Strunk, need find trunk! Strunk, find trunk! Strunk, excited! Strunk, hop up and down in excitement! Trunk! Alright, let's get Strunk back on top of Trunk. There we go. Strunk looks so tiny on top of Trunk. Look at him. He looks like a tiny little baby. Okay, that's a pretty weird looking baby, but you get what I mean. You get my drift. How you getting on with Mad Max? <sighs> getting on good. Hey, we got another metal rock up here. 
We definitely need to stream more Mad Max as soon as possible, and the Phantom Pain as well. Unfortunately, uh, I am in the process of uh, moving right now, so that that takes a little bit of time away from streams and videos. However, I'm going to try to make every stream day that I can. Even, like, though I'm going through the moving process right now. God, I hate moving. Moving is just the worst. Gotta pack everything up, get settled, but whatever. It's for the best. It's nice to, like, um, go into, like, a uh, uh, more homey place, so to speak. Less, like, transitional, you know what I mean? And I'll be able to make my setup a little more permanent since it's not a transitional, like, play. If you guys remember, I actually just moved a couple months ago as well to this uh, median place. I guess median isn't the right word. Transitional is probably the best word. Uh, we need we, we need more wood. We're, we're out of wood right now. Unfortunately, we're going to have to get some more stone pretty soon. I'm guessing. I don't know how much stone we got. But yeah, another good thing is that I will not have neighbors. And that is one of the biggest pluses is that I can, I can like, be however, I li how, however loud I need to do it. If I need to like, do a loud impression, I can do that. Don't have to worry about neighbors. And if we're playing a horror game, I don't have to worry about them like complaining the next day like, <laughs> Sounded like somebody was being murdered up there. No. No, don't call the cops. No one's being murdered up here. Except for my soul. Playing these scary-ass games. Which is a good thing, because we're going to have a very special thing for October that we'll be doing on our channel. So stay tuned. I'll be posting an update video, like a vlog-style update video about... We got plenty of stones. I don't know what I was talking about. About what we're doing for October. So stay tuned for that, guys. Holy shit, Carno. Oh, I don't know if Tron can do this. I don't know if Tron can do this, guys. Oh my god. A truck level 9 killed a level 28 Carno. Look at that thing. That is just... That thing's dead. It's dead. I've never seen a dino more dead. How are you finding the Phantom Pain, Massive? Ah, it's great. It is wonderful. I do wish that Hideo would have had the budget and time to finish his game as he wanted to. However, I haven't even... I'm not even close to the part that's... I'm using air quotes here. Unfinished. I'm not even close to that part, so I don't even, like, know if I'm gonna feel it's unfinished, as most people do. But so far, oh my god, it's perfection. It's perfection. I am having a blast with it. The graphics, the feel, it's just... It's something that I'm, like, it's super excited to play, and when I'm not playing it, I'm thinking about it, and that doesn't happen very often in the games for me. I know a lot about games. I know a lot about the making of games and everything like that. Uh, I almost went into game design. Until I decided not to. <laughs> but, yeah, because of that stuff, sometimes a lot of the magic of games is gone. Because I can look at a game and I know... I, unless it's, like, got some new features or some new tech, or some, like, cutting-edge, brand-new technology, I can usually look at a game and, like, see it exactly for what it is. Like, I know exactly how they did this, how they made this. I know exactly what I can do, what I can't do. I know that I'm not really walking. Like, my character isn't really walking. Nothing has weight, obviously. You know? Stuff like that. Like, there is no magic, blah, blah, blah. The world is dead. Depression. I want to die. Just kidding. <laughs> Just kidding on the last parts. But, yeah, yeah. I don't have that with the Phantom Pain. Just like I don't have that with Mad Max. I'm just excited to play it. I don't even have to think of, like, I don't even think about that stuff. I don't even think about how it's made. I, I'm not, it's not even in the back of my head. It's not even on the back burner. I just want to play it because I'm having fun and I enjoy it. Same with Mad Max. And I love that. I love that so much. And you know what? I felt the same way with Black Ops 3. So I'm hoping, I'm really crossing my fingers that I've, like, continue to feel that way when Black Ops is released. And I really cross my fingers and hope 
that I feel that way with uh, Fallout 4 and Star Wars Battlefront. Cross my fingers. You can't really finish Ark Survival of All Wade. Can't really finish it. It's not the type of game. Getting a lot of stones. Don't necessarily want all these stones. I'm gonna drop a hundred of them actually. Wow. Hundred stones fit in there. Huh. Hundred pebbles, maybe. <laughs> not a hundred stones. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go ahead and grab up some of this stuff. So, we're gonna need a lot of metal for gun crafting, metal pickaxe, metal hatchet, all these things we need if we're gonna start doing the end game of Ark Survival Vault. Need some more thatch. So, we are currently on top of a mountain collecting as much metal as we can, and then we're gonna go use our trike for battle. I want to raise our trike's level as much as we can. We are giving him a break now and then, however. Which is good for him. <laughs> that way he doesn't die like our first trike. Uh, froze up there for a second. The engine does that now and then. Not even having any lag right now. Tame a raptor. They're fast and good at attacking. They're excellent at attacking, and I love raptors. We should definitely tame a raptor, actually. Definitely. We almost did in this stream. Oh, there's a raptor over there. Yeah, we almost tamed a raptor. However, our trike was just a little too good at killing. Just a little too good. At the moment, we're just doing our best to, like train our trike and raise his level or her level I can't remember what it is I'm a bad parent I've abandoned my child I've abandoned my boy but yeah at the moment we're just collecting metal uh, however once we have like cleaned this mountain of metal we're gonna be moving on to battling with our trike and then afterward we should go and tame a raptor What's the difference between flint and stone? Flint is flammable. You can use flint as a like a, a burn source. Among other things. Among other things. Stone you use in walls. The hell is this? The hell? Crystals? Well, that's new. I haven't seen these before. Rare mushroom. What the heck? <laughs> what was that about? Anyway, cross my fingers we get some more metal out of this. There we go. Yeah. 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 You need to drink or you'll die. It's raining right now. That replenishes our hydration so we don't need to drink. Just tuned in. First time watching you live stream. Welcome. Welcome. Good to have you with us. Welcome to the Massive Family, and welcome all you other Massive Family members that are joining us right now for this Ark Survival Evolve stream. Welcome fellow survivors. We need some more thatch if we're going to survive together. What the heck? Whoa! Uh, <laughs> we got more of this! It said special mush- that is bright. That is bright! What? Whoa, what is all this stuff? I don't even remember seeing that. Okay, we got some more thatch. Thank goodness, because I want to build this, like, pickaxe as fast as possible. I really want to get these crystalline mushrooms out of the ground. I've never seen this before. That just gave us stones. Vegeta says crystals are mostly found in caves or on mountaintops. Yeah, that's, that's new to me. I <laughs> have not been to the top of a mountain since around the time the game first came out. So I actually haven't seen these crystals before. Is there a certain way to, like, gather the contents of the crystal? Because my pickaxe just seems to be giving me stones. It doesn't seem to give me anything else. I should probably use a metal pickaxe against these things, but we don't have... 
or we didn't have enough metal. We should have enough metal now. I'm gonna have to drop some of these stones because <laughs> we already got two big ones. We don't need any more. Seriously though, we're over encumbered. I'm not getting any more metal, which I don't like about that. You can gather much crystal with a stone pick. Need iron. Oh, you can't. So I need an iron pick, you're saying. 37 stone, holy crap. Our pick broke. All right, you know what, we have enough metal. We have enough metal to make a metal pick. So we're gonna go ahead and forget the rest of the crystals here. We're gonna forget the rest of the metal. We're gonna hop on our trike. We're gonna battle with our trike and train this bad boy. I need to find out if it's a boy or a girl. Train this bad girl. Train her bad self to be the best damn fighting trike there is on this mountain. Then we're gonna go back to our base, build a metal pick, and, yeah, we're gonna go from there. Maybe get back up to this mountain, get even more metal, and get these crystals. I'm gonna raise her level of stamina. Nice. She is now level 10. We have a raptor coming after us. We're gonna try our best to fend this thing off. Your timing has to be just right. Because you want to attack this thing before it attacks you. So far, we're doing really well in terms of attacking it. Nice. That was a level 29 raptor that our level 10 trike just, like, obliterated with little to no effort. So I am very, very proud of Drunk. She's an amazing trike. Yeah, we're def going back to Mad Max, Cody. Definitely. <laughs> I read the title, Trike versus Everything that I see him beating up a rock. Yeah. We need the metal, though. We need that metal. Is that a truck over encumbered? No, he's just... She's just out of stamina. Just gotta wait a moment for her to, like, regain her stamina. Raise her health. She'll need it. We definitely need to raise her health. However, her stamina was pretty low. I've mainly been focusing on her health. I haven't really upgraded anything else until just now. Let's take down some of these Dillos. They're not much, but they're here. <laughs> Look at that. We just tossed them. Tossed Dillo salad. Oh, man. I could totally go for a salad with some dino meat on it. Imagine this, guys. Dino meat. Right? Following me? Dino meat on top of a salad with prehistoric, like, vegetation. Now, I don't know about you, but that, that sounds amazing to me. Level 29 Dillo. Not bad. Not bad. Seriously. Her health is pretty good, too. She's awesome. This is an awesome, awesome, awesome trike. All right, let's make our way out of here. She's almost halfway to level up. Oh, shit. Oh, damn. Did you see those things? Did you see all those things? Okay, our trike is in, uh, our trike's in hot water. Oh, thank goodness. We need to get out of here. Our trike is almost at half health. Unfortunately, she runs out of stamina almost instantaneously. So we do need to level up her stamina some more. Best dinosaur to get in this game? I mean, obviously, you've got the, like, big names. You got Spino, you got Rex. You got that big gorilla thing. However, I mean, a good all-arounder is probably a raptor. Another good one's a trike because they're extremely durable. As long as you're smart about it, your trike's probably going to last for a long time. <laughs> what is it with you and dinosaur meat? I know, right? I know. I, it just sounds so good. It sounds delicious. Hey, I'll, one of you guys, if one of you guys tells me that dinosaur meat, like, seared uh, over like a, I don't know, a, a, a really heavy-duty skillet doesn't sound good, I will be shocked. I will be shocked! 
Carrie Phillips asks, how do I send you a gift? Actually, uh, I've had that question a lot, so I'm thinking about it, like opening up a P.O. box. And if you guys have like a letter or some weird shit or interesting shit you want to send me, then I'll open it up on stream and stuff and that would be pretty fun. What is with your stamina, girl? It's just gone instantly, man. Uh, Jessica, we'll be doing a shout out. Let's see. Let's do a shout out. Hell, let's do it right now. Shout out to Jessica Turner. Shout out to Stuart Marson. Shout out to Vegeta the Veggie. John Scheffler. Actually, no. No shout out to you, John. Because you said this sucks ass. This game does not suck ass. <laughs> shout out Retracted. Shout out to Agent Eyes. Shout out to Logan Wilkett. Shout out to. Jesse Gamer, or Jose Gamer, is that Jose? That's too easy, it's Jesse. Je it's got a little, a little uh, mark on top of the so I, I'm bad with names, guys, I'm bad with names. Shout out to Captain Headmuncher, Jordan Maelstrom, Benjamin Lindholm, shout out to Nomoto, Ryan Rooney, Firestorm672, Piranhas are eating my trike alive. Shout out to Lewis Felix, Sky Shart, <laughs> Shart. <laughs> Shout out to Tempe Edits, Joseph Chakra, PS4 Gamer, Feds the Gamer, Oscar Shar Sharawi, Sharawi. <laughs> Shout out to Elijah Jones, Dar Zero PT, Eric Frazier, Legendary Boss. Joseph Shuck, I did you twice, I did you twice. Shout out to Sterling Gambit, Gabriel Thomas, Jonathan Dominguez. Oh, Dom Dominguez. Uh, damn it, damn it, damn me and damn name, damn me, damn me and names. I can't do names, I'm so bad with names. Also, our trike just took a shit, and I'm gonna change the day to daytime, set time of day. This is the only cheat that we ever do, by the way, set time of day seven just because nighttime is like annoying what the heck I set the time of day set time of day uh eight let's do eight then there we go uh shout out to danger zone 11 Charizard the gamer polo Berkeley J shall we 82 and the flying spaghetti monster and shout out to Kyler Christie and I think that's everybody. Shout out to you guys. Alright, we are heading back to our base because we're going to build a metal pick. Among other things. We're going to let our dino rest up a little bit. And then we're going to go back out with our trike. Let our trike duke it out with other dinos. Raise our trike's level. We started with a level 8 trike. And I think we're now at level 10. Almost level 11. Let's go ahead and battle this trike actually. Why not? And then once we battle this trike, we may go and try to tame a raptor. Raptor X hard drive. Nice. Two free hits. Three free hits. Good stuff. Good job, Trunk. I have nothing to collect that hide with, so... Whatever. Let's just get out of here. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, Jesus. That's a huge piece of shit, but thank you. Ah, damn it, the trike body's blocking us. <laughs> Get off me! Get off my dinosaur! There we are. Oh, damn, I did, I did forget somebody, hold on. Um, shout out to Viking King, and shout out to Rebecca Banuelos. And Wade Clausen and Terry Phillips. Shout out to Steven Tapia. There we go. There we go. I cleaned up the shout outs. When you tame a T Rex, mm, we're probably gonna tame a T Rex around level 40, 45, something like that. That should be high enough level. What the hell? Oh, shells. <laughs> I was wondering what that was. Okay, we got a lot of flint. Don't have a lot of wood, but that's okay. Let's get that metal. Where's the metal? There, we, there it is. 37 metal. Excellent. 
Let's go and get some more wood to put inside of that furnace. Oh, you don't have any wood on you, do you? This storage box should have some of our wood that we kept for a rainy day. There it is. We want to refine this metal as much as we possibly can, and then want to use it for a metal pick. Thought the game crashed, but it was just stupid Apple asking for a quick time update. No, I don't want to update quick time right now. There we go. And already we have a metal ingot. Let's go ahead and look at our engrams. Uh, metal pick, metal pick. Hmm, no metal pick there. Okay, we gotta apply some Ingram points, it looks like. So, metal pick, where are you? Oh, I already did learn it. That's weird. Oh, can only be crafted at the smithy. Right. Where is the smithy? There's the forge. Where the hell's the smithy? Oh man, you can make a you can make a boat? <laughs> I don't even I don't even remember seeing that. That's awesome. Wooden raft. Uh must have the smithy here. Oh, this looks like it. Yeah, there it is. Alright, so we need five metal ingots. We have enough stones and we have enough wood. And we have enough hide. Sweet. Alright, do we have five yet? Nice. We've got five. And I'm gonna take uh I'm gonna take this wood out. I wanna go ahead and make that smithy right now. Uh, we should have enough stones in here. Yes, we do. Let's combine those, and let's go ahead and make this smithy right now. There we go. There we go! I'm gonna put it right next to our forge, I think. We'll have to see if that's actually a good place or not, but it should be. Oh, this is exciting, guys. Real progress. Yeah, that's not a bad place at all. Let's go ahead and, uh... Well... I mean, I'm not in love with it, but I guess that's good. Maybe over here. No. Okay, whatever. We'll just place it. I just don't like how, like, far away it is. Oh, look at that. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Okay. Let's see. There we go. We need one metal ingot, which we have that. At least I thought we did. Where the hell is it? Huh. Great. I don't have any wood burning. Okay, so aside from a metal ingot, what else do we need for a metal pick? We need wood and hide. I don't know why we need hide, but we do have it. So all we have to do is wait for that uh, piece of metal to smelt itself into... A metal ingot, and then we'll be good to go. Nice. We do need wood, so I'm gonna go ahead and take that wood out. Alright, sweet. Combine wood, one metal ingot, and fifteen hide, and together they form the mighty metal pick! Sounds like the intro to a band. <laughs> the mighty metal pick. Sweet, we got our metal pick, guys. This is our first metal pick. I'm gonna smelt the rest of this stuff. Where's our wood? Oh, we left the wood in there. Great. How efficient are we? Not at all. Horribly, horribly inefficient. That's what we are. Oh, do we have any more wood? Crap, I'm all out of wood. There we go. Not all out of wood. It'd be cool if you could, like, use things you don't like. Like, if you don't... If you built too many fence posts, you could use fence posts and burn the fence posts. That'd be pretty awesome. Okay, craftables. Ingrams. Let's go find... Cementing paste or spark powder. There it is. 
We already have that, of course. I, I've made it. I don't know. I forgot about that. Let's go ahead and learn the metal hatchet. And that's good. Just the metal hatchet. Because that's what we're going to make right now. So I'm thinking that we would probably need two metal ingots for the metal hatchet. So I'm going to just wait here for that other metal ingot. Wow, when you're just kind of sitting here, it feels a lot longer. There we are. Okay. So, weapons, melee, what do you need? Eight metal, holy sh... What? Eight? No way! Okay, that's a, that's a hell of a lot. Okay, while well, the rest of those ingots are smelting, I want to put some more meat on the fire. Hmm. You know what? New plan. I really like the look of this purple thing. It looks like something that Skeletor would have. So... Oh, shit! Damn it! Damn it! Oh, that's really bloody. Oh, that's so bloody. Oh, my God. I did not mean to kill you. One, ar one arrow. Seriously? There's... I hate you once. That's it. I, I, I hate you once. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it all. Although this is a really nice color on you. Sorry, I already have a milkman. Oh my god, that looks so sick. You look plain. You look awesome. You look drab. You look fab. Alright, maybe the ingots are done. <laughs> Enough with our color rhymes. I still don't have enough ingots. See so you guys are saying. Y'all heard about the new dinosaur dildosaurus they're releasing the next update? Oh boy! <laughs> Looks like people can't play this game on their work computers anymore. Check this out. We're gonna ride around in this thing while we're waiting for the metal ingots. There we are. Oh, uh, hey, you guys uh you guys like pinball? I love pinball. When I was at PAX. There was this sweet ass pinball machine, and it was called Doctor Dude, and it was just about like being radicals. This guy that like transformed his life from being this like this uh, this zero to being this radical, awesome Doctor Dude that transforms people like from zeros to radical people. And he had this like this rhyme slash rap that I can't get out of my head. He was like. My life was dull, my life was drab, until I found the gift of gab. Never be awesome, always be... Wait, oh shit. Never be... Never be mean, I'll, always be awesome, never... That's right. Always be awesome, never be mean. Uh, something, something. Wow, I fucked that up. I had this damn fucking rhyme in my head. Every day. For like... Two weeks now, and the minute I try to like get out of my head and like get it stuck in you guys, is that I, I, I screw it up, I forget it, and I forgot the damn poem rap. Oh, way to gay it up, massive. It's not a poem, damn it, it's rap. So maybe it's a spell, like, like I don't know, I don't know. I can't get it out of my head. It was an awesome pinball machine, though. Oh. It played that damn rap about 15 times every game. Oh, yeah, it was free by the way like at PAX It's Penny Arcade Expo. It's this it's this huge gaming convention and Like 20,000 people attend or something like that. It's unbelievably crowded However, this is one part of PAX is like sectioned off and you can like go there and just chill and play all kinds of old arcade games and pinball machines for free Like for free that is so sweet Never in my life have I played pinball that much. Because usually they, those things like are designed to eat up quarters. Oh, I did not realize I had so much meat on me. So you know what? I'm just going to keep the meat that I have. And I'm going to add one more stack. And I'm going to put all this meat on my trike. We're going to use that to actually tame a raptor. Did you hear a shark? I didn't hear a shark. Let me make sure I close this gate behind us. So our dolphin is safe. <laughs> Thank goodness. Gate is closed. Massive, do you still play that app game on your phone? I play a lot of app games on my phone, man. 
Uh, I don't know. We don't. We don't really need to make die yet, though. I, unless we could like die our dinos, which would be just damn amazing. I don't think we can die our dinos. Unfortunately, so I'm not gonna get my hopes up. I'm also gonna refill our water pouches. We're getting ready to move out, guys. It's actually kind of fun, like, pressing 6, 7, 8, 9. It feels like I'm, like, I don't know, inputting a nuclear launch code. We're getting ready to, like, launch off in a rocket ship. When, in fact, I'm just filling four water pouches. Because I made three too many. Because I'm an idiot. Yeah, I like pinball. I love pinball. Take a sip of water. Hold on. Ah, oh, delicious. We've been streaming ARC for about 50 minutes, I think. Wow, it's gone by fast. Maybe less than 50 minutes, I don't know. You tell me. <laughs> you can die dinos. You can die dinos. Wow. I did not know that. Thank you, guys. Still. I like my dinos to be perfect. And the dino colors to be natural alien dinos. Paint on my dinos? Nine! Nine, 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 nine! Nine! Natural colored dinos! That is what I like! Natural dinos! No paints! Nine! Welcome, Sir Nils. Bet that was pretty weird to, like, just drop in on. <laughs> What color are you? Okay, that's that's a drab color. I don't want him, cause then my life would be drab. Let's just keep moving on. May go back up to the mountain before we go after a raptor or continue like devastating dinos with a trike. Wonder what dino paint looks like. I haven't seen it. it must be a new feature. Or a relatively new feature, like in the last month or last two months. You know what? I'm gonna be ballsy. I'm gonna go after this Stego. Boom! 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 Ooh! Got a lot of cheap hits on him. Oh, come on, baby, come on. Come on! What do you got? Man, this Stego looks so badass. I really like it's like stegs on its back, whatever those are called. <laughs> get some of this, uh, get some of this hide with our beautiful new hatchet. Look at that. That is a nice hatchet. A damn nice hatchet. Damn. Mm mm. What's this, uh, what's this pick look like? Oh my god. Oh, we're so fancy. Look how fancy we are. We got a polished hatchet and a polished pick. I feel good. I feel good about that. We also got plenty of Trank arrows. We got 26 Trank arrows. More than enough to tranquilize a raptor. Let's take down some more of these trikes. Unfortunately, our trike is out of stamina. Ah! It's mate boosted. It's mate boosted, but we took it down. It's only level 3, so I believe that we can take its mate down as well. Damn, mating at level 3? <laughs> oh, I question your morals. I question your... Wow, a level 1 and a level 3. Oh, scandalous. Mm. Love sinking my... Metal and it's hide. Okay, I was trying to make a dirty joke, but I couldn't. <laughs> I, I don't know how to make a dirty joke out of like brutally skinning a, a dino with a metal hatchet <laughs> after murdering it with my trike. I wouldn't say the trike is faster in water. Holy crap! <laughs> wow. That thing flew. I wouldn't say that the trike is faster on land than it is in water. It's just that I had stamina when I was in the water, but I'm out of stamina right now on the land. So, he's going to be a lot slower. Okay, I'm going to tell him to follow us, and we're going to go break that thing open. 
There we go. We may also go after that. That beacon in the distance. Oh yeah, this gets us way, way more metal. So worth it, guys. So worth it. Yeah, trikes are super OP, Barmy. Super OP. I'm glad that our trike was like our second thing that we tamed. A little on the slow side, but I can deal. Holy sh... Is this a monkey? Is this a monkey? Oh my god, guys. It's a... Ew. Ew, it's gross. Here, you stay here. Disable following. Are you neutral? Okay. I'm gonna punch the monkey to death because I'm afraid my... I mean, to submission. Because I'm afraid my trank arrows would just kill it outright. I am taming this. I'm taming you. Shit. Crap. Damn it. Okay, it's unconscious. I felt so bad punching this tiny, tiny... Whoops. Tiny, tiny little thing. Uh... I, I can't seem to tame it. Huh. That's weird. Why can't I tame it? It's like it's it's it doesn't have an ear or anything. I really hope that there's not a big gorilla around and that was like its buddy. Alright, we're pretty close to this, so we may just we're gonna go on foot. We're gonna go on foot. We'll leave our trike back over there. Let it defend itself and gets attacked. Wonder what's inside of this. I don't remember what level the green beam correlates to, but it's still all good. Whoa! I almost punched that stego. That's it. That's it. This is a blueprint. This is a blueprint for a Parasaur saddle. Who the hell needs a damn blueprint for a Parasaur saddle? Who doesn't have, like, the Ingram points or, or the level to learn a Parasaur saddle? What the hell? What? What? Oh, I, I'm just like... My mind is blown right now, and I can't, I can't cope. We got a goddamn Parasaur Settle Blueprint. That is what we got. And that is BS. This is major BS. Where's our trike? Where's our trike? Oh, it's over here. Can't believe we got that. We got a damn Parasaur Settle. What the heck's up with that? Welcome, Penguin Penguin. Just joined up with our stream. You have to feed it and run, not knock it out. Oh, damn. Jessica, where were you two minutes ago? <laughs> I'm just kidding. Okay. Well, I, now I feel bad. It seemed to run away from me, though. So I was kind of afraid about actually, like, uh, approaching it. Alright, I'm gonna go approach that monkey. It should be awake now. With some berries. I assume that's what it eats. It probably likes narco berries the best. I'm guessing. I mean, not narco berries, you know what I mean. Uh, uh, Mejo berries. That's what these are called. You still down, little... Little guy? Little monkey? Oh no, it's still unconscious. Oh, that sucks. Well, let's head to the top of this mountain and get some of those crystals. Mm -hmm. The crystalline entity. Whoa. Hey, buddy. Think you got something wrong with you. <laughs> You're all shaking and crap. Look at you. It's got the jitters. It's not even cold outside. In fact, my guy is hot. And thirsty. And hungry. Oh my goodness, look at all that metal we're getting. We're getting mad metal! Yep, Sharky, that is a new update. Monkeys. There's also this huge gorilla type thing. And it's pretty badass. 
I don't know where to find it. I haven't encountered it myself. I don't know, maybe it's on a test server or something. Drop some stuff we don't need, like those rocks. Um, this. That's good enough. Let's keep getting that metal. Get that metal! Stimberries to wake him. Uh, I don't know if we actually, I don't think we can wake him, actually. I don't think we can even feed him Stimberry, so we can't enter his inventory. You know, we can't enter his inventory. The monkey can be trained with pellets, or it will just reset after a short time. Okay, so let's not even bother, bother with the monkey, because we got to have pellets or some fancy stuff. I have not watched Steven Universe, but I have watched Adventure Time, and I enjoy Adventure Time a lot. My favorite at the moment would have to be Rick and Morty. It would seem that I'm stuck. Oh, I'm just too heavy to move. Okay. Holy crap. Looks like that is the stone's fault. I mean, the metal's fault. That we're so over encumbered. Mm mm mm. How about now? Can we move? Can't move. We're just gonna have to drop our metal. 103 metal. We better get back here quick, because I don't want to lose that metal. I don't want that metal to, like, despawn. Oh, shit. <laughs> Thank God we hit that rock, otherwise we probably would have died from impact. All right. Hey, there's a little monkey. Hey, little guy. I don't have any weapons, see? Hi. Hi, how are you? Put taming food in the last item slot, okay. I doubt these berries will work. I think we need something special. Damn it. Get back here. Damn it. Damn it! Ah! Forget it. Forget it. We'll approach him again later, after he's forgotten about us. We gotta be more stealthy. We weren't stealthy enough. Please don't despawn. Please don't despawn. Also, Trunk, don't step on that monkey. <laughs> Don't do that, man. Seriously. That would suck so bad if you just stepped on it. Like, primitive monkey destroyed. That monkey could have been like the lineage for George Washington. Who knows? There's not that many monkeys on this planet. We need our chance. <laughs> yeah, he is... that Or she, because it's a female monkey, I think. That monkey is fast... I don't even know where that monkey is. Too bad there's not bananas in the game. Too bad. I'm gonna be hungry pretty soon. Come on, Trunk. Keep moving, Trunk. There we are. You can do it. Okay, we're almost back to where we dropped our metal. Almost back. Come on, Trunk. Just a little further. Walk, damn it. Ah, oh, fine. I'll get out on foot. Oh, please still be here. Please still be here. Metal, metal, metal. Where are you? Oh, it's gone, isn't it? It's gone. Oh no, all that metal, 103 metal, gone. Gone! No! Why did it, how did it disappear? How and why? I want answers, damn it. Did it just keep tumbling down? Okay, I'm gonna subscribe to the theory that maybe it just kept falling. Maybe it just kept falling. How far could it possibly have fallen? Strong's punching the air, he's so angry. 
Stroke angry. Stroke missing metal. Stroke punch air and frustration. Stroke, you're not gonna get that metal back. Ah. I really wanted that metal too. Oh well, let's go look for that monkey real quick. Holy shit. Bigfoot. Motherfucking Bigfoot. How do we tame Bigfoot? Please tell me we can tame Bigfoot normally. I think he's smarter than normal dinosaurs. Shit. Okay. Let's be very... Oh, damn. He sees us. He sees us. Bigfoot sees us. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I'm going to move up a little bit. No wonder we found that little monkey. Mm. It's level six. It's been in a fight recently. It appears to not want anything to do with us. Oh, sh shit! Shit! Oh my god! Oh, it's coming after us. It's hostile. It's hostile. Oh god, I went too close. Oh, I went too close. Oh, how can I get away? I need to get away. I need to get away. I, I, I need to run. I need to run. That's all I need to do right now. And once it stops pursuing me, then maybe we can try to tame it again? Oh shit, we got a lot of insects. Oh my god, an awful lot of insects. I can't move. But those insects will corner you. And like, once they do, good luck moving out of the way. Good god, look at all these things. Okay, they're all dead. And Bigfoot has, uh... Stop pursuing us. Damn it. Go away. Go away. I got important shit. We'll play later. Alright. We got one more to die. There we go. They died. And more after us? Jesus Christ. Damn insects. Okay. Now that the insects are out of the way. Where is Big There's Bigfoot? Okay. God damn, we have another insect. I hate you! I hate you! Alright, insects are dealt with. Oh, Bigfoot. Bigfoot, Bigfoot, Bigfoot. Let's be very, very quiet. When you guys said I cannot tame the monkey until it's level 40. Bigfoot butt. I don't like looking at monkey butt. Okay. 90% effective taming. We fed it a berry. Oh, it's not hungry though. I got an idea. What if we build a fence around it? Hey, 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 hey. I'm friendly. Don't come after me. You hungry yet? It's not hungry yet. It's weird. And it's creeping me out, honestly. It's gross. That is a, that is a where did, what the hell oh there it is. Fast. That is a gross, gross looking thing. Ew. Ew. How big is it compared to us? There we go. Let's see. Pretty damn big. Almost double our height. <laughs> okay. So, we are going to have our trike duke it out and battle against other trikes. So let's go hop on top of our trike. Let's hop on pop! I guess that's not accurate. This is a female trike. Actually, we got a little bit of metal here. So while we gather this metal, we're going to talk about what we're going to be doing. We're going to be leveling up our trike as much as we possibly can. And just keep leveling it up and leveling it up and then battling other stuff. Battling other dinos. Parasaurs, trikes, carnos, raptors, dillos, you name it. It's actually surprisingly powerful. I mean, we have fought against level 40 raptors and our trike has come out like relatively unscathed. Don't worry, our trike is not that unfortunate. Slow. One that just jitters and walks in place. 
No, our trike is, uh... Our trike is the one behind us. Is that a... What is that? I don't remember... I don't remember a ball of energy like that. It might be a new type of beacon. Fences do not work against Bigfoot. Interesting. Good to know. I'm gonna remember that. Oh, see, I forgot to eat, and now we passed out. When you guys said it takes like eight hours to tame a Bigfoot. Okay, now that's ridiculous. <laughs> Let's go ahead and wake up. Come on. Takes a minute. There we go. All right. We're just gonna eat some raw meat. It doesn't hurt us that much. All right, Mr. Tri Mrs. Trike. Sorry about that. I'm gonna put this metal on you and we'll be good to go. Let's move out. Level up available for you. All right. So we're gonna access the inventory and level up stamina because she runs out of stamina way too fast. It is ridiculous how fast she runs out of stamina. I want to go look for things to kill. Maybe a raptor to tame. We'll see. I don't know. There's a parasaur down there. Unless it's a high level parasaur, that's not going to yield us much XP. So I'll just keep moving on. Keep our eyes open. Surprisingly, this area is kind of clear. We've got these annoying bugs. Looks like that may be it. This is the area where we saw the raptors. We saw a stego over here too. There we go, finally. Something to kill. One of these turtle things. Whoa! We just punted that turtle halfway across this plane. Looks like it may be mate boosted. I'm not sure. Yes, that is mate boosted by this badass black one. Nice color on that. Look at that. Looks so awesome. Looks way cooler than the purple one. I wonder if it's almost dead. It's certainly taking a lot of hits. We gotta watch out for our health. We don't wanna die. Excellent. We killed it. Oh no, we didn't kill it. We're just killing insects and drones. Luckily, our trike's health is just fine. Like, our trike is having no issue here. No issue whatsoever. I'm gonna go ahead and eat some of these berries. To keep our health up. Good stuff. Hitting both at once. Yes! Jesus Christ. It's another Bigfoot. <laughs> That one's got different coloration. Maybe male and female Bigfoots have different coloration than each other. We're just gonna pound this thing into submission. Should be close to death. I'm gonna bet one more hit. One more hit. Hey, good timing. I was right, one more hit did it. That's weird, that's weird. Our health isn't going back up, we have half water and it looks like uh, we're okay on health I mean on hunger not health obviously we're not okay on health let's eat some more berries I guess in the meantime not exactly sure why it's not recovering I'm gonna go ahead and head back to base. This is kind of weird. Okay, so we... What the hell? How the hell did I die? Alright, so I definitely should not have died there. Because I... I ate plenty of berries. And I had a 
almost full, like, water meter. I'm gonna go ahead and recover our trike. I may go on foot, I'm not sure. I'm gonna cook some meat before we go. Access inventory. Let's take that meat with us. Alright, good stuff, good stuff. That was weird. It was the heat? Really? It was the heat? I died from heat? I wasn't even walking, I was just riding on my dinosaur. Huh. That... Okay, that's gotta be a new feature, because I didn't know that, uh... Temperature changes, like, were that severe, where if you weren't even doing anything, you could die from heat. Did not know that. Did not know that. I guess I'll strip naked next time. <laughs> I don't know if you guys want to see a naked Strunk, but Strunk will strip for you. He will strip for you. Not even for money, no, just to cool off. <laughs> wow. I mean, most people have to strip to, uh, like, I don't know, make ends meet, but Strunk has to strip to stay alive. Heat strong. Good one. Good pun. We got 15 minutes to get back to our trike. We can do it, though. We can do it. And we're gonna do so on our Parasaur. Alright, that should be enough meat to tide us for the journey. I'm not gonna worry about water. Let's go. Let's do this thing. Oh god, that Parasaur looks so awesome. Awesome looking Parasaur. Damn, so cool. Luckily, our Parasaur is fast, so we'll just have our Parasaur follow our trike once we actually, like, complete this search and rescue mission. You serious? I'm hot. I'm, I'm hydrated. And I don't have any clothes on. And I'm and I'm riding a dinosaur. I should not be hot right now. <laughs> they should add a breeze functionality. Where if you're riding a dinosaur... Holy shit. Holy shit. That was a huge croc. I've never seen a croc in this river before. That's the first time I've seen one. Oh my god. It's big and it's coming after us. Luckily our parasaur is holding up pretty well. Jesus Christ. This is usually a pretty peaceful strip. I mean, look at all these peaceful dinos. You got trikes, you got stegos, you got parasaurs. It's not bad. It's not bad over here. Once in a while, I get a dillo, but that's about the most dangerous thing you'd see. That, uh, that crocodile. That's pretty new. That's pretty new. All right, you know, I'm going to go the rest of the way on foot. No, come on. You stay here. Excellent. Stay there. I'll be back. We're gonna go get our track, we're gonna get trunk, we're gonna get our gear, and we're gonna come back to Melkman. We're gonna take both Melkman and Trunk back to base. We might kill some stuff before we go back to base, but that's the basic plan. Okay, Trunk should be just past this area. Um, is that a car now? That looks like a Carno. I think that's a Carno. I don't have anything to. I don't have anything to shoot him with. I don't have my arrows. Uh, I need to get to my body. My body has Trank arrows, and it also has my bow. I think it was past this mountain, actually. Yeah, it was. Crap. We got. We got a ways to go, and I have no water. My body has water on it, so... I can just... I can just get the water off my body. This is gonna be tough. This is gonna be really tough. And I'm out of water in real life! No! No! Hello, not my trike. Mind give me a ride anyway? It's a pretty sick paint job you got. Okay, we should almost be to our trike. Should be pretty close now. 
Trunk! There, is that you, Trunk? Yeah, I think that's Trunk. I don't remember what whistle we gotta do. Trunk, get over here. Trunk, please, I'm naked. Damn it, Trunk. There we go. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, damn, where's my body? Yo, Trunk. Oh, no, Trunk. Trunk, where's my body? Oh, thank God, he was standing on it. Oh, thank God. Whoa, that was my inventory? Oh, those are Ingrams, okay. Huh. Excellent. Now, let's... go ahead and put some of this stuff on. We're not gonna put too much on, because we don't get hot and die from heat. <laughs> so, I'm just gonna... I'm out of water. Almost out of water. Little bit of water left. I gotta eat some berries. So let's do that right now. Once we eat some of these berries, we should be good. Hydration wise. Excellent. I'll eat some more later. Let's go, Trunk! Uh. Let's try to tame that dino that we saw. It's a little ways from us, so we got a little bit of a trek before we reach it. Damn it, we're slow again. <laughs> you know what? Our trunk doesn't have a bad paint job either. It's just, he's, she's so slow. She's so slow. She runs out of stamina so very quickly. This is a tank, okay? This is a tank dino. If, if you don't want an impenetrable, extremely strong thing that is also slow, don't use it. If you want, like, a the dune buggy equivalent and not the tank equivalent, go with the parasaur or a raptor. I do look at the chat, yeah. I definitely look at the chat. Right now, we are just making a trek in our, uh... On our Triceratops. Trying to find that, uh... I don't, I don't remember what it's called, actually. It looks like a... What's that Pokemon that was in Diamond and Pearl? Quiz for you Pokemon and knowledge freaks. It was in Diamond and Pearl. You could find it via fossils. It had a hard top to it. Like a hard skull. And it was blue. And it could run around and, like, headbutt things. What was that thing called? That's what this dinosaur looks like. Can't seem to find it, actually. Not exactly sure where it was that we saw it. It was around here, though. Maybe it was over here to the left. I'm not seeing it. Where is that dinosaur? Pachysaur? That's how it's pronounced? Pachysaur? Yeah. We're looking for that Pachysaur right now. I've got my eyes like absolutely peeled, but I'm not seeing it. Oh, it looks so sweet. Damn insects. <laughs> Damn pests. Alright, we killed them. We don't have to worry about them anymore. Cranidos. Thank you. Cranidos. 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 And there it is. There it is. We got it. We got it. <laughs> yes. We're on the same Cranidos. Oh, that's a cool. That's a cool looking one. Nice. Looks mean as hell. Shit. Oh, shit. Please, please faint. 
Please faint. Do not attack my trike. You'll die. Don't do that. Trike. Trike. No. Stop it. Damn it. Fuck you. Language. Yeah, I know. Language. Damn you. Damn you, trike. I know you're trying to protect me, but... Oh. Oh, I wanted it. Oh, I wanted it. Great. Now we got these mate boosted things to kill. It's not that I don't like your company. I do like your company, Tron. It's just that I really wanted Kranidos. Because it's so cool. Damn, turtle's taking too long to kill. You're taking too long to die. Let me speed that up for you. <laughs> Saying that made me feel like a creepy nursing home hospice attendant. <laughs> You're taking too long to die. Damn it. They would never say that, though. They want to string those people along, keep them alive as long as possible. So they can keep getting the money. I'm looking around for another uh, Pachyosaur, but I'm not finding it. Where the heck are these Pachyosaurs? For those of you that are saying, do a bedtime story massive, uh, we may be doing a, a parody ASMR video with Duke Nukem. So, keep your eyes peeled for that. I doubt anyone would actually be able to use it as real ASMR or go to sleep with it. But, uh, it should be funny. <laughs> Look at that, we got an island over there. I think it's attached, I can't quite tell from how it looks over here. Still pretty cool. No, I'm not seeing any packy source. Mm. Oh man. I really wanted a tame one. All these damn dotas around, but not a packy source. Wait, what's that? Ah, oh, it's a parasaur down there. I don't want to tame another parasaur. I tell you what, I wish, I wish we could have tamed that awesome looking flying creature. It's gone now. Wait a second. Here, follow me. Follow me, but be passive. You passive, you're neutral. I want you to be passive. Nice. Alright, let's go. I see this thing flying around. I want to tame it. Where'd it go? There you are. Whoa. Whoa. There it is. Yes. Yes! It's unconscious! Where is it? Great, it's it's halfway in the tree. It's adorable as all heck. Let's remember it's at this tree. I'm gonna go get our Parasaur and bring it back. I'm gonna have our Parasaur and our Trike be side by side. And we're gonna come back to that tree. And we're gonna tame that thing when it gets a little hungry. Oh my god! Oh shit! Almost died. Almost died. Did not realize we were running off a cliff. <laughs> that could have ended really, really badly. Where are you, Mr. Parasaur? There you are. Come with us. Oh my god. Is it dead? Oh shit, Parasaur. Melkman! Melkman, no! Oh god, Milkman. Milkman saved my life. 
Fuck. Milkman was killed. What level is this thing? Shit! Oh my god. Oh my god. This is like... This is torture. This is torture. I've been... I've been killed multiple times. My house isn't finished. Milkman just died. I died. This level 19 thing will not go down. We fired like eight trank arrows in it. What the f- Ah! Ah! Mm. It's unbelievable. Unbelievable. That damn infernal thing just wouldn't fall. It wouldn't- it wouldn't faint. And I don't know why. I don't know why I wouldn't faint. We fired like, what was it, like eight trank arrows into it? And it, it just wouldn't go down. Oh my goodness, why wouldn't it go down? Oh. Rest in peace, Milkman. You will be missed. Seriously, I, I loved you like, a, like you were a damn brother or sister, whatever gender you were, I can't remember, whatever, I don't care. I loved you so much, Milkman. <laughs> Even though you slept with my wife. All right, we're gonna have to go back and get our things. It's gonna be dangerous, so there it is. There it is. It's still there. Damn it. Damn it, it's gonna be dangerous. Is it dead? Oh, it's unconscious. It finally fell unconscious. Level 19. We're gonna tame this damn thing. I don't care, we're gonna do it. We have enough, uh, we have enough meat. <laughs> Ew. Oh, Strong's legs. They're so short. They're so short and they have so many muscles. Alright, let's just take all that stuff and let's not look at his naked body for too long. Mm-mm-mm. I'm sorry, Milkmon. Looks so sad. Milkmon really did die to protect me. Milkmon died for me. Died for us. Good night, sweet prince. Goodbye. I'm actually feeling a little bad. I'm I'm actually like I'm feeling remorse right now. I'm feeling bad about this. We have any meat on us? Alright, we do. We do have meat on us. I don't think we'll be able to tame him in time. How long does it take to tame a Sarko anyway? We gotta get back to our trike. Make sure our trike's doing good. A damn Sarko. Can you mate with the Bigfoots? Oh, Jesus. Sir Gary Coleman, excuse you. Can you mate with the Bigfoots? What the hell kind of a question is that? Jesus Christ, man. Can you mate with the Big... What the hell is wrong with you? Whoa! Okay. We fell quite a distance. Made me nervous. We need some more meat. We need a lot more meat. I'll take this. Thank you. Also, I'd rather it be daytime. There we are. Can you eat Milkman? <laughs> yeah, we could. Would Milkman want it that way? I'm actually just leaving him alive as like a chest at the moment. Which is absolutely horrible of me. His Milkman died for us. Died so we could live. Where's that... Where's that little flying thing we took down? Did you wake up already? No, it's probably attached to another tree, wasn't it? It's probably this tree over here. Where's that little thing? Oh, maybe it was at this tree. I was positive I was going to remember the tree that it was at. But now I don't remember which tree it was at. Oh, let's take a step back. Look at all the trees. It's got to be this tree. It's got to be. Crap, we're thirsty. It 
Yeah, it must have woken up. It must have. Because it was, it was right here. And now it's gone. Shit. We're just losing everything today. Everything. We lost Milkmon. We lost this thing that we were trying to tame. At least our trike's okay. Feels stuck. Our trike... Okay, our trike is unstuck now. It was, though. We're gonna go to Milkmon's body, and... You know, let's kill this Bigfoot. I don't know if we can. Yeah, I think we can. Look at this. Ha! Look at that. We killed the Bigfoot. Hopefully they're not smart enough to, like... I don't know, were other Bigfoots? No, we've killed one of their kind. And they resent us for it. I don't know, that was pretty easy. Not bad, not bad. Took a couple swipes, went down. Massive, are you streaming today? Love the streams lately as usual. we oh, streaming right now, man. Are you not supposed to be on your thing? <laughs> we're on our thing, we're on our trike. We're heading back to our Parasaur. Our Parasaur's dead bot. Are you attacking me? Nah, he's just trying to make his way. Alright, hey. Hey, listen. Listen, I'll step out of your way. You can walk on. You can keep stepping, and I'll just uh, I'll just go behind you. There is that good? You pushy son of a bitch. Yeah, a milkman died of a croc attack when protecting us. You see, a sark was actually coming after us, and we were we were on the verge of dying. We had a sliver of health left. And he saved us. He died so that we could live. There's his body. And there's the there's the uh, huge crocodile type thing, the prehistoric thing. Mm -mm -mm. I'm sorry, little guy. It's my phone. You were a bro. You really were. You were, you you looked out for me. Even this trike. This trike kind of looks out for me, but. You were an OG. You were a true player. You were there from the start. You know, I respect that. I'll never forget you, Milkmon. Never. In fact, I'm making Milkmon 2, just for you. Ooh, don't drop all the items. Take all the items. Okay. Get over here. Get over here. Come closer. <laughs> we gotta drop some stuff. We're too heavy. Oh, uh, let's drop, let's drop the wood, and the rocks, and the meat. Ah, uh, we're still too heavy. Okay, we gotta drop some other stuff. I guess we could drop, drop this wall. Can we, can we walk now? Ah, uh, we still can't walk. What do we have? What do we have that's so heavy? Is it... Surely it's not the berries. Is it the berries? I think it's the berries. I'm gonna I'm gonna drop some of the berries. It was the berries. Wow. I did not realize they were so heavy. Alright, you know, I'm actually gonna open up your inventory and put some of this stuff away. Right, let's transfer some of these heavier items. Don't need to be carrying the uh, chitlin or any of these seeds on us. We only need to carry things that are like immediate. Stim berries, meat, stuff like that. Don't need thatch either. Or hide. Let's go ahead and put the armor on ourselves. Put some of these berries away as well. Stim berries are useful, so I will keep the stim berries on us. Put the spoiled meat away. And the rest of the seeds. Alright, sweet. Looks like we're good. Nice. Alright. You ready, Trike? Let's move out. Let's leave this infernal place. Where our friend has died. Put the wrong boots on. There we go. Boots. And Swiper. 
Can't tame them. We try to tame Boots. We need Food Pellets to tame Boots. And Boots' father and mother take like eight hours to tame, so we weren't able to tame them. Berries are apparently 500 pounds if you can't even move. What? Oh, yeah, like in real life. <laughs> you couldn't carry enough berries where you couldn't move. That's true, yeah. I mean... They just gotta balance the game, so that's why. You can't move because of berries. <laughs> what the hell's attacking us now? Is this piranhas? Okay, it's just piranhas. We don't have to worry about those. As you see, like, our trike... Do you see? Do you see? <laughs> our trike is not taking any damage from that. That's... that's... nothing but a thing. However, if that was a croc attacking our trike, we would be taking some serious heavy damage. But we are not, so we don't have to worry about that. Tried attacking that parasaur, but it's a little too fast for our trike to take down. Unfortunately, there's no really, there's no real way to get this game for free. I mean, you can buy it on a key site like G2A and get it at a discounted price, but it's not a free-to-play game. Yeah, an entire rock wall. We were carrying an entire section of a rock wall with uh, stones and mortar. Yet, berries were heavier than an entire rock wall. How weird. How strange. Yeah, that truck didn't care about the, those piranhas. It was like cave fish to him. If you guys have ever been in a pet store with cave fish and you stick your finger in it, the cave fish will swim up to your finger because they can feel the vibrations. They're actually blind. And they'll just, like try to nibble on your finger. They will, though. It's a weird sensation. In fact, I think that there was some type of fad a couple of years ago. Like a video of Kim Kardashian or some crap like circulating the internet and she had her feet in this spa water where these fish were like biting it and nibbling on it and like sucking on it and try to... They're trying to say that this would like treat your feet and get the dead skin off your feet. Of course it's all BS, but yeah. That's what those piranhas out of this trike. Just a spa treatment. Not a day of the spa. Alright, sweet. We are back home. Sadly, we are uh, one less in our family. You'll be missed. Mohman. Wait, what's that? Oh, we gotta repair it. Well, I need wood, thatch, and fiber to repair it. So... Mr. Trike, Mrs. Trike, I keep getting your gender wrong, and I'm truly sorry about that. Let's get some wood, and thatch, and fiber. And let's repair this thing. How do we repair it? Do I... Holdy? There we are. Sweet. A dino must have damaged it at some point. I'm gonna store everything that we don't need back inside of here. Store that armor for now. Store that slingshot. And remnants of our death. We can't actually store these, unfortunately. Store that pickaxe. We don't need that. Oh, it's full. That's why we can't store anything else. Well, let's store this thing. There. Everything we don't need goes in here. Awesome. And we had better actually get to cooking some meat. Let's also check how our plants are doing. And tell you to stay here. Don't get into trouble here. I'm going to set you to passive. So you can like... I don't know. Protect yourself. And disable following. You're free! Partially. Still bound by contract. Keep that in mind. Plants are slow as hell. Oh, because we're missing fertilizer. Oh, crap. Didn't take long for the fertilizer to run out. Also, <laughs> a dolphin's trying to escape. But it can't. It can't get out. The gate is impenetrable. 
You have any fecal matter? No. Do I have any fecal matter? Wrong button. I'm trying to let one loose. I, f I completely forgot how you take a shit. I don't use that option very often. Yeah, we, we don't have any fecal matter inside of us, I guess. So we're just gonna actually borrow this. I thought I saw fecal matter, I didn't. Weird. Maybe it disappeared when I turned around. And we're just gonna borrow some fecal matter from here. Actually, yeah, we got fertilizer, nice. We didn't even need the fecal matter from there. We're gonna use the fertilizer over here on our plots. Because these things eat shit like there's no tomorrow. There you are, fertilizer for you. No seeds there. Do have seeds here, we're gonna just put some regular shit there. And we're gonna grab some narco seeds from Stronk's trunk and plant those down. Where are the narco berries? There it is, narco berry seed, excellent. P is the poo button, I think. Uh, Shrock's constipated right now. I did press the P button. I guess that didn't work. Fertilizer. Narco berry. Excellent. And it is irrigated. Sweet. We ought to keep up on that fertilizer business. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> Looks like we are coming up on our time limit. Thank you guys for joining us for our latest journey of Ark Survival Evolved. If you did enjoy, then join our massive family. We do all kinds of streams all week long. And hit that subscribe button to join our massive family for more Ark, more Mad Max, more Phantom Pain, more gaming. And if you enjoyed, leaving a like helps out, so there's that too. But yeah, I would continue streaming, unfortunately. Uh, my tongue is... it's. A bit irritated and I think that that's because of my neck my tongue and my mouth it, it gets problems whenever I whenever I get stressed in my neck uh, I pulled a really bad yesterday so I gotta take a little easy however we do have some epic Metal Gear Solid footage coming up so stay tuned for that like you guys have been waiting for this it's quiet we found her we found quiet just all of a sudden like I was shot off of my horse I, anyway <laughs> We found quiet. That'll be coming up pretty soon. Full 1080p, 60 FPS, lossless quality as much as I could make it. And I'm going to work on taming that huge crocodile. So, uh, whether I'm successful or not in taming that huge crocodile, we will see in the next episode of Ark at the beginning. Stay tuned for that as well. Until next time, guys, game massively. Take care. Live on YouTube around 4 p.m. EST, Monday, Thursday, Friday. Follow for notifications.